I'm Kiki Fun here, and welcome back to Sally Face Chapter 3. Let's jump back in with the Balagna. So, I believe we were trying to figure out what's going on with the Balagna. Maple Chip. Oh, uh, hi, Larry. Hey, Maple. Aren't you going to eat your lunch? My mom made me peanut butter and jelly again. I'm just kind of tired of it, you know? Uh, I mean, if you're not gonna, of course you can have a chug. Heck yes. Chug, you're a fatty. Knockfell Warriors? Uh, hi, Travis. I thought I smelled trash. What are you flavors up to? Get bent, Travis. Don't you have some sandwiches to attend to? You're lucky it's baloney day. Dude, you got some issues. Oh! Hi, Kim. Hi, Kim. We want to ask about the baloney. Could you tell us where the school buys it from? Why well, you want to know about baloney? Yeah. Something wrong with Kim's cooking? No, no. We were just wondering where it... You can go and sit back to chairs now. No more questions. Do you think we just see the package or no packages for you? Just butts and chairs. Go on. Well, that was a failure. She always seems so unhappy. I wonder why she stays here. I think the kids make her sick or something. Dude, what if the kid is poisoning the lunches? I don't know if this town has room for another conspiracy theory, though I guess it's worth looking into. Why don't you see if you can sneak into the principal's office to look at her files? While you do that, I'll check in with Todd. Alright, I'll see what I can do. No, no packages for you. Into the hall! There's a class in there right now. Ooh, different lunches. Oh, it's pie! Hi, I, ah, finally, nope, I don't miss that, I don't miss that at all, it's a paper clip, right, paper clip, paper clip, woo, do we get to pick a door with that, I want to pick a door, I want to pick a door, pick, 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 pick with my pickaxe, Mrs. Packerton's classroom, I don't know why I said Pickerton, uh, 201. Science lab. That's where Todd should be. Einstein, evolution, baloney. Seems out of place. Find anything? Not yet. Were you able to get the baloney ingredients? No, not yet. Where's Ash? She went to get some materials for me. I recommended she look in the janitor's closet. I thought she'd be back by now, actually. Alright. Thanks for your uselessness, Todd. Ew, sticky tack. Dude, I loved that sh in school. Holy crap. Sticky tack, I found this time. It's kind of fun to play with. Hell yeah, it's fun to play with. And my friend's lockers. Ooh, lockers. I was thinking doors. One of these things are not like the other. Oh, no water fountain for me? Screw you too. There's class in there right now. Courtyard. Oh, hey! Hey, what's wrong? The damn closet is locked. I need something in there to test the baloney. I tried to pick the lock like Larry showed me, but now my hairpin is stuck in the keyhole. It's jammed up good. Hmm. Could use some pliers to get that out, but... Yeah, they'd be in the closet or with the janitor, but he always leaves for lunch. I'll see what I can find. Thanks. In the meantime, I'm gonna keep trying to get this out. Thanks. You uh, screwed that one up. Into the courtyard? Oh. Oh, what the ball? Oh! That actually worked? I, I don't- I don't understand how I managed to shake an entire tree without trying, but okay. It has a smiley face! Oh, it had a face! It has a face! Why do you have a face? Snorkel tennis ball. That is not normal. There's a face on it. 
Don't lie to me. The teachers are in there eating lunch. So maybe I want to peep. Wait, did I just say birds? I can't see them. They must be hiding. Uh, okay. Not sure where that was going, but okay. Into the hall. Oh! Hey, Larry. Missing? There's missing posters. Any luck? Teachers are on the lounge. I'm waiting for the right moment to sneak by. Okay, then. Back to the cafeteria. Why is room? Let me go in the girls' room. So I'm not sure why I came in here. I better not. Called it. Oh, okay. Creeper, corn, and muir. I heart metal. Oh, that's awesome. That picture of them in the corner. Oh. Oh, Larry Nash. I think that's an older drawing that Ash made. She actually taught Larry a lot of what he knows now. She's a great teacher. We may have never become close if it weren't for Larry. Huh. Larry's hard stuff. He's so messy. <laughs> In a way, I sort of admire that carefree mindset. That's one of my paintings. I was gonna throw it out, but Larry insisted on keeping it. He said great art doesn't need to be beautiful as long as it conveys genuine emotion. And I feel the shit out of this man. I really do. Thanks, dude. Nice backpack. We've been through so much over the last few years. He's more than my best friend. He's family now. I don't know what I'd do without him. Aw. House locker. Just some of my textbooks. Todd suggests I take visits this year, and I'm actually enjoying it. The world we live in is fascinating and filled with mystery. Oh, they all have the same picture! Picture of us from Halloween. That was so fun. I'm lucky to have such great friends. Thought you knew Ash because of Todd, but alright. I've had this backpack since I started going to school here. It's a little worn around the edges. Oh, okay. Ash makes these stuffed dolls. I think they're cool. She calls them little dudes. Ash's art supplies. Ash and Larry are such good artists. They try to teach me, but I'll never be as good as they are. It's okay. I have fun painting and drawing with them, and they never make me feel bad for not being good at it. So I love that they paid attention to detail and actually show his reflection in the mirror. That's kind of sick. Let's see. Oh, hey, that's me. I didn't know she had this in her locker. Aww. Some of Ash's photos. One is an older picture of her and Larry. I'm so glad I met those two. Ash's Polaroid camera. She's always snapping pictures with it. This could come in ha handy. I'm not. I'm sure she won't mind if I borrow it. Take it. Really? You have a light bulb in there with a potato? Oh, why am I not surprised? Todd is never short on supplies for his inventions. I don't know how he does half the things he does. This guy is a genius. This potato light thingy was a science experiment that Todd showed us in class. I'm surprised it's still going. Not much of a surprise that Todd's locker is half filled with books. I really admire his passionate curiosity and hunger for knowledge. Todd. Oh, I called it! Todd and his boyfriend, Neil. They're always so happy when they're together. That makes me happy, too. Aww, that's cute! Aww. Guess that's everyone's. Well, guess that's it for me. Uh, cafeteria. Oh, so I just looped around. Hmm. Let's see. 
So, I'm supposed to help. And hey, Sally Face. How's the detective work going? Not great so far, but we're still looking into it. You guys are wasting your time on this one. I'm telling you, this is good baloney. Nothing wrong with it. Everything tastes good to you, buddy. <laughs> she has a point there, Chuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In any event, I hope you're right. Ugh. What do you want? Suck it, Travis. And I don't like you, Kim. Something about you. Something about you I ain't liking. Not too keen. Any luck? Teacher's on the lounge. Alright. Um. Do I take pictures of birdies? She said, I need to find a way to get their attention without them seeing me. Maybe if I make a loud enough noise. Wait, would the camera work? Maybe it's loud. Maybe. There's much film left in it. Still a tennis ball. Found the courtyard. Throw it. Yeah! Go, go! Huh? What was that? I don't know. It sounded like it came from outside. I don't see anything. Neither do I. It was those damn birds again. Can't see them. They must be hiding. Okay, so does that mean they moved? Probably not, knowing my luck. Did you get past? Yeah, good thing with that distraction, dude. I saw her file. Awesome, anything to help us? Well, I had to book it, so I didn't get a good look, really. If we can distract the teachers again, maybe I can just take the file. No, we don't want to draw attention to ourselves by stealing the file. Alright, you're the boss, Sally. So what should we do? Give me a minute, I'll think of something. Give him the camera! Here, use Ash's camera to take picture of the files. Great thinking, dude. Ready when you are. I'm still not over the fact that this has a smiley face on it, but what Ebsies. What Ebsies. Showtime. Alright, Beetlejuice. It's showtime. Huh? What was that? Oh no. Sound like it came from outside. I don't see anything. Who do I? Those damn birds again. In the same dialogue. Did you get it? Dude, the file is missing. What? How can that be? No one else would have could have went in there without you seeing them. Heh, <laughs> just jerking your chain, man. I got the picture. Oh, you butt nozzle. Ha <laughs> ha, score. Let's take a look at it. Dude, the fact that you use the word butt nozzle, like, that might be my favorite insult right now. <laughs> Oh, that's great. Knockfell High School teacher information. Name Kith Kim Yazzie, bird 10, 1267. Hey. Address 3 Fair and Way, Knockfell Fields, 555. Lunch Lady. No, it's Kim has elephantitis. Elephantitis? I'm not sure I pronounced that correctly. I hope I don't offend anyone. It's not contagious, and she is sensitive to it. Make sure the other teachers know. Tell Kim to stop beating the birds in the courtyard. Other teachers get annoyed. I think I know what to do. I'll meet you back in the lab. You got it, dude. Oh, I'm not gonna make fun of her, am I? That's mean. Ugh. Ugh, I'm gonna be an asshole. I feel like I'm gonna end up being an asshole. I don't wanna do this. Get out, old boy. Leave me in peace. Uh... Okay, so... Get baloney from Kim. So, do I gotta go mess with the ladies' birds? Is there a missing poster missing, ironically enough? Birdie, birdie, birdie. Hmm. 
Don't tell me I feed them sticky tack. Okay, so I'm supposed to do something. I don't know what to do. Huh. in there. Got that baloney yet, dude? Working on it. Alright. Nope. So, do I need to find birdie food? I'm supposed to do something with the birds, but I don't know what. Am I supposed to go piss off the teachers again? I'm supposed to do something. Alrighty then. Got him. All right. So, what is it? Hmm. Let's see. Is there something in here I missed? I feel like there might be. I'm missing something, and it's right in front of my face. So maybe I go piss off the teachers? Piss off the teachers? Maybe? Hope they didn't see me. Birds. Hmm. 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 Thank you for your humming, but what what do I do? The teacher's lounge. Alright. Can't believe Larry was able to get into the principal's office with all the teachers right next door. I can't leave. We need to finish this investigation before lunch is over. Can't leave. Can't believe Larry was able to get in the principal's office. Teacher's Lounge. Okay, there's something I'm missing and I don't quite understand. Um. There's something I'm supposed to do, but what am I supposed to Alright, I, I figured... I don't know what I figured. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Amateur photographer! So do I give her the... Do I give her the... Do I take a picture of the birds? Is that it? Do I not feed the birds, but I take a picture of them? Oh, did I figure out a thing? Did I, did I do it? Did I figure out the thing? Hmm. 
birds. There's a much help use. All right. Birdie, birdie, birdie. Here, yeah, birdie, 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 birdie. Oh, am I close? Oh, am I getting closer? Hi, birdie. You're pretty. I like you, birdie. Okay, so I don't feed the birdies. Oh, I'm dumb. Didn't I think of some- I was thinking about taking a picture of the birdies earlier, too. Ah, uh, I suck. <laughs> Alright. Onward! Hi. Got a picture for you. I got something for ya. What's this? A photograph? A birdie? You take picture, eh? Yeah, I took it for you. Just a small thanks for all the hard work you do. You're a sweet boy, Sally. Thank you. So I was wondering, can you tell me where the school buys the baloney from? Why are you so interested in baloney for? Oh, well, um, my friends and I really like it and I want to know where we can get some. It's local, made by Mrs. Packerton. 100% beef. She brings from mom once a week. Here, I give you some extra meat for bringing Kim a nice photograph. Thank you so much. Okay, but I still never got the pliers to help Ash out. But I guess that's not important. Onward! Am I going the wrong way? Hmm, there's something fishy about you, Mrs. Packerton, and it's not 100% beef. Got more baloney. Perfect. Kim said that it's made by Mrs. Packerton. Whoa, no way, dude. She lives in the apartment. How can she make her own lunch meats? Oh, yeah. I forgot she lives there. I hardly ever see her. I've probably seen her in the building twice since I moved here. She tends to return at late hours. I believe she keeps multiple jobs. Teachers don't get paid as well as you may think. It's fairly common. However, when Mrs. Packerton is home, she makes quite a lot of noise. It's very peculiar. So what do we do? Should we ask Miss pa ask Packerton about this outside business of hers? Or are you boys going to do your whole detective thing? Huh, <laughs> I don't know. What do you think, Sal? Let's do a little snoopy before going to Packerton. I don't like the way this is playing out. If something nefarious is going on, it'd be best not to let Packerton know what we're that we're looking into it. Agreed. Good call, Sally. Alright, why don't you and Larry go check out Mrs. Packerton's classroom while the teachers are on break? Todd and I will finish testing this baloney. Exactly what I was thinking. Okay, we'll be back. Larry, I'll need you to be my lookout. Wait by the door in case anyone comes down here. You got it. Hmm. Damn, she keeps her desk drawer locked. Remember how to pick the lock like I showed you? Yeah, but there's no keyhole. The combo lock? Shit, dude. How the hell are we gonna get that thing open? Let me take a look at it. Only goes to six. Aww. Is it the ah? Uh, it's the pie, isn't it? Three, one, four. Yeah, pie. Woo! Got it open. Nice one, dude. What's inside? Just a bunch of math papers and. Hold on, there's a hidden compartment. Man, there's some freaky stuff in here. What is it? I'm not sure. Oh, okay. Little jars filled with look like spices, maybe for cooking. It's a Bible. The book is really old, but there isn't anything special about it. A bunch of papers with random notes and symbols scribbled on them. Looks like they're written in another language. I can't make any sense of it. Crystals? They're actually kind of cool. I wonder what Packerton uses these for. Remember last time I took something without looking around? Oh, I should have a bird skull in here. That's kind of creepy. Is that it? Alright. 
Strange metal object similar similar to Jim's puzzle box. This could be important. There's another one of these metal boxes like the shit. Is it happening again? The fuck just happened? Yeah, I oh What the fuck? <laughs> Sounds like Doodle Bob. <laughs> Are you sure? You could just be dehydrated. You didn't eat anything for lunch either. It's done. Huh? It's already over. But never mind. Let's go check in with Todd and Ashley. Hey guys, we found some sketchy things in Packerton's desks. How are the tests coming? We're not getting any signs of harm, well, chemicals or bacteria. However, I think we can all agree there's something peculiar going on here. Whatever it is, let's not mention this to Chuck for now. The poor kid almost had a heart attack when they stopped serving meatloaf. Yeah, Ash is right. Let's keep this under wraps until we know for sure what's going on. Well, I guess we know what we have to do now. Damn, I'm gonna miss the action again. I have to watch Ben until my parents get home. Maybe we can help out after that, though. Later that day. I'll need a few minutes to get it ready. Oh, that's cool. I have to take care of some things first anyway. Okay, let's meet up in Todd's room once everyone's ready. Yes, perfect. Cool. Alright everyone, well I think I'm going to end the video here. Thanks so much for watching. The turn of events of this is getting really bizarre and I like it. Let's just keep going further down the rabbit hole, I suppose. Anyways, uh, if you like this video, please leave a thumbs up or a comment down below and please feel free to subscribe. Any type of support is really appreciated. Well, thanks for watching guys and as always, stay awesome and stay geeky. Bye bye.